is a bar for connecting your electrical components and it's called bus bar. a bus bar. Let's take this copper, three quarter inch copper tube and make a bus bar. First we got to measure it in the middle and then cut. Okay, I'll get this here cut. Okay, we're going to show you the difficulty of making a bus bar. And we have like, uh, what is that? About five feet? Eight feet? What is that? That's five? Five feet. Five foot bus bar. It was a ten foot stick. And this is the difficulty right here. You can use a hammer. The hammer's easier. If you have a hammer, it won't be as smooth because of the hammer, but it will work. And if this vise was mounted down, it would make it even easier, of course. Okay, we're just working it. Okay. Joe's like, this is just a pain. We're going to screw this thing down right here, right now. Yep. We're not messing around here. Put it at an angle. That makes it a little easier not having to hold it down and try to turn it. All right. So this is how you make a quick clamp. And he's getting it completely smashed. Yeah. Got a lot more to go. <laughs> Five foot more to go. Four foot, not six inches. <laughs> Joe MacGyver right here. Pretty slick. These bus bars to buy cost you a few bucks. This this length of copper was what would you say that was, Joe? Seventeen dollars. Seventeen dollars at Lowe's for ten foot of three quarters. All right, and you notice how flat that is. All right. Then he's bringing it up and catching the bottom side now. Okay. And he's working that vise, that handle, getting it tight. And he's coming back. And he's doing it again. Alright, getting it as flat as possible. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna flatten this out with the hammer, because it's got a slight curve here. You wanna grab a hammer? We'll grab a hammer. We're gonna caveman style this. Boom! We're not crying all the time. Yeah, over here. Hound, 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 hound. We're hounding. Getting her done. Yeah, getting her done around here. Over here. That's how we do it around here. Hound, 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 hound. Ain't nothing like a hound dog. We're not crying all the time. We get her done over here. Right here. Hound. <laughs> Uh, gotta keep it interesting, folks. <laughs> gotta keep it interesting. <laughs> over here! Right here! You know what I'm saying? You know how we do it over here? Sorry. Hound, hound, hound. Hound dog. Crying all the time. Yeah, no, we not. We get her done around here. Know what I mean? Know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Yeah, over here. Hound, 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 hound. Joe don't mess around. You get her done around here. We ends over here and know how to do it, right here. Yeah. What I'm talking about, Willis. Yeah. Over here, hound, 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 hound. We'd be doing it, working smarter, not harder. You know what I mean? Taking the time to do it right, right here. Bound. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? We'd be getting her done. Not now, but right now. Over here. How, how? All right, making this bus bar in all seriousness. <laughs> Just trying to have some fun, you know. That way you don't know what I'm throwing at you next. Over here. How? We'd be getting her done right here. 
be making a roller coaster. Roller coaster. How? <laughs> Joe's over there manhandling it. Yeah, getting her done. Not now, but right now. Taking the time to do it right. That's what I'm talking about. Willis. Hey, Willis. Yeah, right here. Willis. Yeah, right there. Nope, nope. Right there. Yeah. Nope. Yep. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Taking the time, see, to do it right. Pays. It pays to take your time if, to do it right. Now, when you got to do it, figure it out, take your time, get it done, get it done right, right, yeah, right, right now, right here. Oh, you know, we're going to get this finished up right here, and we'll be back to you in a minute. It's all right, catch y'all in the rebound. Yeah, right now, right now, right now yeah, right now, right now, right now. Now, I was getting ready to, to drive this enclosed and then work the rest of it. But Joe told me he did that and this end was twisted. And check out what he had to do to, 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 to fix the twist at the end because he did it and it was twisted. How he solved this problem. Okay, Joe, how did you do that? I had to solder one end shut and stick an air hose in the other and solder that and so I could balloon it back, to, back up. So you took, the, what, 120 pounds of air? Yeah, just about. And I heated up the pipe just enough where it ballooned itself back up. So you heated up the pipe to kind of relax the metal and you stuck the pressure in there and it allowed it to, to blow come back, back up, come back. Come back where it's supposed to. Wow. And then I got to pound it all back down again and do it again. Rework it. Good job, man. That's thinking outside the box. Well done. All right. We're going to get her done. Ken, no. What? No, we're going to solder this together. What do you mean? We're gonna solder this thing together. What, what? But we didn't do that last time. Yeah, I know. It's a loss of power. Loss of power. Yep. You, you mean lose the nut and bolts going through it. You to lose hold power the through the uh, the nut and bolt. Oh yeah, that makes sense. So we're gonna solder the wires directly so, to it. Okay, so you can drill holes through this, and it yes. will work. But you'll lose power. But with, through the, with the nut and bolt going through it, connected to the connector, it causes electrolysis. You have a lot of decay, a lot of acid-type buildup there. Um, and so you're going to have to constantly clean it, and that can cause other problems because you're using baking soda. And so you want to use solder and solder your wires in place. It's a good, clean connection. And uh, you shouldn't have all those issues. And, it, and if you do, it should be far less. So that's using it on this bus bar. So we've had fun. Tried to keep it interesting. First time to do a video where I'm just kind of clowning around and, and, you know, having some fun here. But uh, this is how you do a bus bar. You can drill holes, but soldering is better. Now, Joe's saying he had taken a air hammer, chisel, air chisel, and he cut the end off of one of the spikes. Then he welded a flat piece of metal on there, probably like 3 sixteenths quarter or bigger maybe in thickness. And then you could do that to pound this flat or anything else. Joe's the MacGyver. That's why it's Joe MacGyver on his channel. So like, subscribe, check out Joe's channel, and share. I look forward to hearing from you. Bye for now. God bless. Take care. And as we always say, never give up because there's always a way, always united we stand and united we make it happen. Bye for now. Bye.